everyone, my name is Ebolon and welcome to your channel. This episode is breaking episode, yes, about PAL world. Let's dive to the video. My name is Ebolon here and we are going to talk about the first virus software happening in 2024. PAL world, creation of Pocket Player Studio, an independent a game studio based in Japan. We want to talk totally about the game. The game is kind of open world sur survival Pokemon. Oh, sorry, not, I, I, I said Pokemon. No, I didn't say anything about Pokemon. Imagine if you had AK in Pokemon and you can butcher the creature. Well, that's a cute game and funny and crazy and actually entertaining in the same time. You know, the game crossed the line. The game sold over 6 million copies in first four days of early access. So it's, you know, something else. It's the crush the industry in first few days of 2024. So so actually we are very hyped about uh, future updates or future things but you can play up to 32 players in one server in one map and as your with your friends the game has so many stuff to talk about but there's a thing we are going to talk how the hell they inspired to create such a game actually when you think that remedy got sued by just you know using an r that the r is look like the rockstar logo when you imagine the, you know, power, the first thing you can actually imagine, is it Pokemon? Is it, I don't know, a spin-off of a Pokemon? Is it a copy? Is it or not? You know, when you see the characters, there are cues, but you know, the first thing you remember is it's Pokemon, but no, it's not Pokemon. You know, they're just have the idea, but you know, some weird stuff happening around this game. You know, you go, first of all, you see a cute, cute creature in the nature. You can say, hey, hi, I have a boy, I can kill you. If, after you kill him, take him, just like a game I don't want to mention. And then you use it as labor in your base. He helps you watering your seeds, you harvesting your seeds, helping you automize every line of the your factory. All the stuff, all the details in the survival and the building, even one part. And then you imagine that every solo single cute creature can help you in building that. So that's another part of the fun stuff that's happening around. And there's option. You can butcher it if you, you feel hungry. That's so much realistic, putting some unrealistic wolf. That's huge. Wow, six million copies sold in four days, in first four days. Why is this is working? Why I, this idea is working? And that's, you know, the magic of independent game industry. You know, actually no triple A would risk such a thing in their games. No one makes Call of Duty with Harvest Moon. But independent, yeah, welcome to the magic world. <laughs> Going so, on out there in the game industry and actually in the content industry. Copyright, we have everything. So when you cross the line of copyright, when you say it's copyrighted. So there's a few reasons why PAL world is exploding out. First of all, uh, Nintendo games are exclusive to the Nintendo consoles. Now, all pe uh, people out there does not have consoles, Nintendo consoles, so they don't have reach to games. So, one of the example is Pokemon, you know. First, PAL World is not copy of the Pokemon. It's copy of a few other stuff too, you know. Zelda, Pokemon, Valheim, Minecraft, everything. <laughs> but, you know, there's something going on. You're, there's a whole character's design is actually created by one person. How it's possible to do all this stuff by one, you know, solo. So, there's something, you know, you have to actually pay attention so when we cross the line of the pool you know somebody's outside and say hey nintendo nintendo is just left you have to sue you know some people are upset about that and so they are staying and defending a pokemon title you know you have to sue it it's a pure copy what do you mean by that but you know we have some copyright rules and if i if i want to say it in very simple way if you are using other somebody else content in your content it should be transformative you cannot just take the video of the movie and use it in your content it's that's a pure copyright yeah so it should be a uh, transformative 
transformative. And as transformative examples in this video, you know, you can use the Pokemon characters, you know, just inspire and change this something. And I want, you know, I want to clarify something. Nintendo is one of the most aggressive companies out there, you know, and when we saw the history, there's some fan-made games, you know, inspired by Pokemon and other stuff. They shut it down. They shut the fan-made game. You know, imagine what will they do to third-party companies that is using their content and making a lot of money. So, no, actually they will sue. At the time, exactly at the time, which they are actually sure about that, that we, they can win this in this war. And actually they need en enough evidence because if the Nintendo starts a war and losing it, everybody will start using their content in their games. You know, today is just one and tomorrow it gets more and more. So the Nintendo is not asleep, they are waiting for exact time. And if the exact time, exact time arrive, they will not hold it and they will not show mercy. You should be sure about that. Nintendo will not show mercy about that. So we want to talk about more and more. First of all, Pokemon is exclusive. You know, Napal World is not exclusive. Everybody can reach out for it. So this is a one winning point of Pal World. And using all the mechanics from all of the games, actually collection of survival and using Pokemon elements. Actually, it's not Pokemon game. It's you know, just survival game using Pokemon elements, you know, capturing pals, creatures, and cute creatures on the map. Their names are pals. Every pal have specific abilities and you can use them and actually you can eat them at the end. <laughs> you know, you can butcher it and end it. Yeah, that, that's, you know, some all crazy elements in this. I think it's fun, but you know, I'm not kind of, you know, going fast to the decision. No, it's copy, it's copy. Go, it's it's copy and you know, nothing else matters. But actually the today's industry, when I see the world, you know, the car industry, all other stuff, are going to use this copy version. You know, China is using it all the time in kind of way. So some other stuff around AI generated content, you know, speaking around there, that is AI generated. It's possible to use AI, my angle of view, using AI as you know generating characters or other graphic parts when there are somebody out there with no job you know that you are hurting the whole system because the generative AI will not replace an artist at the last point it's just using the actually experiments that happens by artists up to date you know it never can be that generative at all he done it well they actually he done a great job actually to attracting players player and good plays break the record of CSGO and other stuff we have a series of actually a story of pixels and codes in this video you can you know actually there is a link out in the outro of the video you can go and watch the other stuff and other games and how they make everyone here